it was Michelle Ford who brought my attention to the idea that Congressman Adam Schiff has sponsored essentially a resolution declaring that the federal government has never paid out even a farthing, even a penny for injury of citizens by vaccinations. Michelle, would you now correct the record for us? Adam Schiff is saying that there's no credible evidence whatsoever of vaccine injury, yet the federal court of claims has paid out over $3.7 billion since the National Childhood Vaccine Injury Act was passed in 1986. It's ridiculous to make a claim that vaccine injuries don't exist when the government is regularly paying out vaccine injuries. So I love to go to the momstreetjournal.com because she's got all of the embedded links and you can quickly and easily locate the federal court of claims report that will bring you right to the federal court of claims. Because if you try to Google it, you're going to be on a little bit of a rabbit, <laughs> rabbit hole witch hunt looking for that thing. But it's right there embedded on her articles. Lori Gregory is a blogger and a mom and she has done incredible research on the federal court of claims and actually one year ago today november 29th 2016 she reported on a flu vaccine injury payout increase of almost 400 percent and then shortly thereafter when the 2016 report came out she issued another blog post indicating that the flu vaccine injury had increased by an additional 1188 percent over prior year well, it's hard to fathom how a member of congress can deny reality it's like saying the sky isn't blue or rain isn't wet it is an undisputed fact i don't know if mr schiff is seeking contributions from big pharma or why he would promulgate a lie, an extraordinary lie, 